was approached by Bertha Rendon. Bertha is actually curator of the show, along with Mo uh, Monica Maldonado, um, and they put they put this together to how do you say they put it they brought the show together and curated it around Mexican culture uh, artwork um, to bring it back to the community and just to showcase skills that you know the East Side Austin neighborhood. Uh, can do. I, I'm a car painter, so my artwork revolves around painting panels and uh, the way I can sh like do designs and stuff. As far as with uh, with, uh, I, I kind of showcase both my art skills, drawing and painting skills together um, into one. Um, so that's why my artwork's a little different compared to acrylic on canvas or you know hand drawing or something. I also do have a handkerchief. Uh, drawing in there um, that took about a month long and it's all a big pin on a handkerchief um, I call that like more like my prison art and prison style um, yeah but, and then I have a uh, one more in there and it's a it's an aluminum panel painted with candy paint and then I painted it across and slapped it on there and glued it to the aluminum panel and framed it so it's really good very nice to me feel really good as an artist because this is actually one of my first shows that any of my artwork has been showcased in and uh, when they approached me with it I was very excited like like what and like seeing all of this stuff and all of this going on inside it's like really an inspiration to keep on doing it because I can see how much I see how big art can be like as far as for other people and myself and what got you into art um, I've always been an artist as I mean and I'm really talented at that I just really haven't tapped into it as much, but now seeing what can ha happen with with my art, I think I'm just gonna keep up with it and keep on doing it. But I've just always been a drawer. Tell me your name one more time. Uh, my oh, name no. is uh, John Eric Kalunga. Let the heart come through. 